All right, we have the Yellow Jacket 4-ton, 8,800 pound dual piston jack. This thing is heavy duty with a one year guarantee. You'll want to stay tuned because I'm going to show you my two ton jack next to this. And I couldn't believe the difference in size, actually. So you want to stay tuned for that. Comes with a handle that actually can snap into place for extra torque. How easy it is to jack the car up. First, you're going to want to get the jack points, which on every car has notches. That will be your safe spot to line your jack up right there against a frame as I point to it there. And you want to line it up so you want to get to on the ground first and just get that there. And then I could actually get the truck lifted up just by laying down. But if you need that extra torque, Trust me, it's right here with the extra long handle, and that makes it even easier. I could have even just used one hand. Um, you definitely need a lot of space, as you can see, because I'm actually right up against my car there, but it gets it up very, very easy. And letting it down, I can even do it laying down. Just twist the handle, no problem there. And look how easy and also how smooth it goes down. Not a problem. You definitely want a jack that can do that. This jack exudes quality and craftsmanship. Um, the fact that it can lift up a truck, obviously it can lift up a car as well. And I'll demonstrate that here quickly for you. And again, we're just gonna line it up on the frame and Again, I could lift it either laying down or do it standing up, not a problem. And there you go, letting it down. It actually lets down again very, very smoothly. Just twist very subtly and you can see it goes down very slow, as slow as you want. Or you could do it as fast as you want if you just continue to twist. Here is the jack up close. You can see the rubber base there. Um, that will then go up against the frame. The handle is hollow, but it is made of a really good quality metal and it's not gonna flex at all. It's a nice touch to give you the padded handle on the bottom. Here is a nice close up of those dual pistons. They definitely are powerful, and as you can see, the jack is lifted at its highest right here. And then I'm going to just release the pressure, and it is a smooth way down. Twist it back and lock it in place, ready for another lift. All four wheels are made of metal. The ones closest to the handle, those two uh, can rotate 360 degrees, where the ones two on the other side are fixed. Now we're gonna lift the car up from the center. Again, we wanna find a nice solid place to put the rubberized pad onto, and then we can start to lift. And again, it's effortless with this four ton jack, again. 8,800 pounds is more than sufficient for a car. Cars are anywhere from three to 4,000 pounds and then SUVs are, uh, you know, in the five to 6,000 range. So you still have quite a few pounds left over, which is gonna give you that ease of motion and lifting the vehicles. And here's a close up of the pivot point where you twist and release. So here is the, the jack, the four ton jack next to the two ton jack that I'm replacing. And wow, what a difference indeed. I couldn't believe my eyes when I put them side by side, but I've been using that two ton jack and um, I'll tell you, there's a big difference in regards to ease of use when using the four ton jack.